Ijabi, I'm from Ibadan, your state. Mr. Speaker, thank you for recognizing me since you believe I will still benefit from this bill. Mr. Speaker, this bill is very, very compulsory. <laughs> uh, if, uh, it's very, very important. Mr. Speaker, when it gets to the um, committee stage, I would like for amendment, for, instead of it being optional, I think it should be compulsory. As um, Honorable SAN mentioned, that in some countries, the progressive countries, they are giving them, um, their men paternity leave up to like three months, which is compulsory. Because for a new wedded couple, Mr. Speaker, who has nobody to help them, his only wife and the husband, and they're put to bed, definitely the husband must be half time also to, jo uh, to jostle between his obligation work and the new kids. Mr. Speaker, and it's important, it's only women that need to bond with the, uh, with the kids. Man, also, we need bonding with our newborn baby to understand. <laughs> we need bonding with our newborn baby. So, Mr. Speaker, this bill is very compulsory, and I, I want to urge our colleagues to please pass this bill. And again, Mr. Speaker, Access Bank has already passed this, something that looks like this. They give um, any... any any man working with them, a week off for paternity leave. Mr. Speaker, as I said, is very, very compulsory. And even in this house, we have some, some of our colleagues that have four kids, quadruplets at once. Who will help them if the husband is not around? So it's very, very compulsory. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. I so support.